don't want that force. You need it very gentle, like this. And then it cleans it. Hello everyone, please welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you another DIY project. It's a simple project. You can enhance your bathroom. Today I'm going to install a bidet on my toilet. This project will help you out in your DIY project in case if you want to replace your toilet seat that one is old or broken or has a stains and you want to change it. So that thing uh, you can change it but in my case I'm installing the bidding and you can do two things. You can install individual one if you're not changing your toilet seat cover then you can install the bidet like this. And I'll show you the installation of this one. It's very easy and simple to do it. In this bathroom, I'm going to install the bidet, but that bidet is already included into the seat. This is like this. And this is also very easy installation. So as I give you the option, if you're installing the bidet, this is a good one to do it in case if your seat covers are not good or you want to change the seat covers then this is a good option but if your seat covers are good and you want to install a individual bidet then you have the option so let me close it and i will show you how easy and simple you can do it this is the toilet i have where i'm going to install the bidet so this seat was initially installed the toilet seat so i just removed it and i'm going to discard that and I'm going to install the newer one, which is this, and it's going to get installed right in here. And this one is already bidet is inside, and we need to hook up the water line. So these are the accessories. It's very simple. This is the key we need to install, and uh, then we're going to install the hose. And very simple. So let me show you. So the first step will be you turn off the inlet water and the second step is you flush the toilet and when you flush it make sure that you press it all the way after flushing the toilet we're going to make sure that uh, if there is any water inside the toilet you press it down once all the water is drained out what you need to do open it the valve like mine is like a hand tied. If it's too tight, use a plier to open the nut. And try to put something underneath of the water and also put some rag or towel. So if there is any water, it won't make any mess. See, as you see, it start to leak out. So you need to make sure that any water inside the hose. This is the one we need to install. The washer is provided. We're going to install the washer. Then we're going to add the Teflon sleeving on these sides. You do the same hand tie, just like that. You really don't have to force it. This is pretty good snugly tied. The other side goes on top. We're going to put the Teflon. After adding the Teflon, we're going to tighten it. For this one, you need to tighten with the wrench or a plier. So I'm going to use a plier and we're going to tighten it. nicely tighten this side will goes on the ball right here so once it's a hand tight we're going to make sure that uh, we tight with the plier you don't have to really over tight it this is really good nicely tightened now we're going to install the top mounting bracket 
this is the hardware is provided and each uh, one comes with a different style so once uh, we put this one on and uh, this one you keep the alignment and these are the bolts are provided so those sits inside this cavity these are the two nuts we're going to put the nut on so we're going to make sure that it's nicely tightened this is the nut make sure that the round shape goes on the top so as you see this is the bolt this is the mounting nut goes on top of it we're going to tighten and we're going to make sure that we tighten it so this is the bolt and this is the mounting nut so we're going to make sure that it's a hand tight At this moment, you don't want to over tight those nut and bolt. This is the bracket because we're going to see the alignment, how the alignment, then if we need to move around, then once it's all set, then we're going to tighten it. And now that we're going to put the seat, if you look at the bottom of the seat, these two will goes inside of this, and this side will goes on the side. We're going to put it like this. As you see, sits in the groove, and then we need to slide it back, just like this. You heard that click. So as you see, it looks all fine. If we need to make adjustment, we can move a little back and forth. So now it looks good. Now I'm going to go back, and I'm going to hand tight it really good. The other side of the hose, we're going to connect it right here. Add some. Teflon we're going to tighten it once it's a hand tight we're going to use the plier we're going to make sure that we tighten it don't over tight so once it's nicely secured, the next step will be just to make sure that all the connections are secured and now we can turn the water on. As you can see, it's perfect enough. So it's all filled up. And if we take a look here, now we're going to check it out, all the connections. There is no leak. There is no leak. And good way to check it, get a paper towel and just put it like this and see if there is any leak. It look all fine. So there is no leak. So it's all look fine. We're going to place the cover back. So the first thing we're going to flush it. And now I'm going to test it. Get a container or something, you put it just like this. This one has a couple setting on this side. This is for the front. As I put the container here. You don't want that force. You need it very gentle like this. Another side, this one opens up like this. And lot of force. So you've seen it, it was easy and simple to install the bidet. And uh, I hope this video will help you out in your DIY project. And uh, only thing I would suggest uh, after like a half an hour later, go back to the joints. If there is any leak, make sure that uh, you tighten it a little bit. And that's it. Also, I show you the performance. It's really working great. If you found this video to be helpful and uh, like, share and subscribe to my channel. And uh, don't forget, I'm going to install
another video to install the pump. I'm going to show you also this one. This is the second alternate you have. I'm going to install it in my other bathroom. 